Good morning world from this bright and beautiful day heading out for a beach walk straight first thing in the morning charge up that spirit for the rest of the day make us feel nice and motivated it is an absolute dream to be able to walk out to this every single day even though we don't do it every single day little poppy up front leading the way what a dream <laughs> I don't think I need these. I'm trying to be extra conscious of the things to be grateful for. Today, it's fresh air. It's something that I don't even think about anymore because I've been away from like city life for so long and we've been living in countrysides, farms, you know, for, I don't know, maybe 10 years. So now here, living on this beach, breathing in this air, it's another thing that's very special. Poppy, come. Wow, it is so fast. <laughs> yeah, it's a bird. You're making up a song. It's a bird. Yeah, let me hear the song. Flutter, 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 fly in my house. Flutter, 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 flutter. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you can. He's a crazy little dog, isn't she? Whee! Look at the colour of that sky. Beautiful. Let's do a bit of wave appreciation. Oh, she brings us such happiness, doesn't she? <laughs> Stay. No, we've never ever had a puppy before. <laughs> hey! You don't realise how difficult it is to train them. Puppy! There really is so much for her to learn, but we want to get her used to coming back to us on command so that we can trust that when we take her off the lead, we'll be able to get her back. Sometimes she goes so crazy when she's excited that it's hard to get her to listen to you. I guess just like any child. It is nice for her to go free on the beach though. <laughs> Ever since her stay in the vet and when she's come back after recovering from parvo virus, we've had her on a leash everywhere we go because we don't want her to eat another dog's mess or you know pick up something that we haven't seen where it's come from. It has definitely changed the way we treat her. <laughs> she's hiding in the shade now, she's probably hot. It's the first time I've seen her off leash actually for couple of weeks now we really want to get her used to walking on the leash like next to us as well but she's pulling a bit now she's stronger and older takes some time we want to order some training treats you can't really get training treats on this island but they'll definitely be useful so that we can reward her for staying close and coming back to us you want you to be a good doggy I think she will be the story Alright, if I can be the leader of this, of, of this land. You want to be the leader of the land? Yeah. <laughs> you can be the leader of this walk if you want. Yeah? yeah? I like being the leader. You like being the leader? Is that your leader's stick? Yeah. yeah? Can you tell me, Story, what are you happy for today? I was happy to um, just drink a piece of water. You're happy to drink water, like drinking clean water every day? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. What else are you happy for this morning? I'm happy because I like finding heart shells. Oh, okay. Heart, heart, heart rocks like this one. That heart made you happy, yeah? That's brought you the first bit of joy of the day? Yeah, the first... The, the first bit... Yeah. The first, the first rock that was here... Uh -huh was a triangle rock and now we can put this rock next to the triangle rock. Okay, like an art installation. Mummy, I found a heart rock. Shall I show you where? Show me where it goes. Right behind that rock. Yeah. Alright, lead the way. What? Lead the way. Where did, where did it go? Oh, look, we are finding our triangle rock which is right here which fell down. This 
triangle rock was special yesterday because we got it yet from yesterday and now um, we decided to put the heart rock that I just found today next to it and daddy is putting it next to the triangle rock Woo! next to or on top um next to okay is that okay that triangle rock used to be up leaning on the tree but then it fell down you want it to lean again like that yeah and you can lean that again like, like that yeah too. yeah oh that looks so cute that looks so cute all right <laughs> oh job done you happy with that look yes i'm happy look at that right now we're ending and i hope you enjoyed this video and see you tomorrow and sweet girl <laughs> She's really happy with that. Good morning, Eden. And straighten your picture up. Speedboat. <laughs> Show me your speedboat that you found. Oh, it does look a bit like that. Grateful for this tropical view and grateful for good coffee, which is going to be next up. Story's going to give coffee her medicine. You really love doing this job, don't you? Getting the air bubbles out. All right, Poppy's ready. Look. <laughs> Isn't that like gobbler? Yeah. <laughs> this is one thing I'm not thankful for. Hmm? You need to stop grabbing our shoes. The minute we get home, you take our shoes. Drop it. This belongs over here, Pops. Play with this instead. Ready? Fetch. Good girl. Poppy. What is it with you and our shoes? Leave the shoes alone, please. Story's about to dive into her breakfast. I'm a million hundred... Um... Hungry. A million hundred hungry. A million hundred hungry? Oh, you got a big bowl of breakfast to eat. Looks yummy. One of our subscribers sent us this massive bag of tableo from Elvira Farms. And we've actually had some of this type of tableo before and it's lasted us a long time. It's really good stuff. So a huge thank you to Wilma for that. We'll be having that for most likely <laughs> six months. <laughs> we don't have much of it. We have like a, a secret hot chocolate when Story goes to bed normally. Yeah, sometimes we do, don't we? <laughs> and sometimes we have it with you, don't we, Story? We put peanut butter in the tableo once. Yeah, I do remember that. It actually made it nicer. It was, yeah, it gave it a, more, a richer taste, didn't it? The garden outside has been recently landscaped as well. It's looking much clearer out there. Actually, there was a really nice bush here which had some beautiful pink flowers on it, which I quite liked. It was turning into a bit of an arch, but it would have been too overgrown had it gone too far. It is looking extra clear out there. Oh, goodness me, Poppy. This has to stop you. Drop it. Look at this, she's actually delivered the lamb to the shoe station and then taken the shoe. Three, two, one, fetch. Researching some puppy training techniques. Hey, no, got my shoe again. <laughs> Get off my shoe. <laughs> and then, ah, oh, give it back, give it back. No, 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 well, I've got it. They were saying how if you leave all of a dog's toys out everywhere, then they lose their value because they're not special anymore. So you have to put them away after every use so that they can regain their value. So maybe you're done with this one. You taught me that, didn't you, Story? About putting Poppy's toys away. Listen. Yeah, because we thought we were right and we thought you were wrong, but actually you were right, weren't you? Yeah. You were putting Poppy's toys away all the time and I kept saying, no, don't put them away, leave them out so she can play with them. And what did you say? I said no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then we found out from the experts that that was the right technique, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Very clever. Thank you, Story. When a dog's not using them when they're resting or sleeping, they can put them away because... Otherwise they might lose one of them. Yeah, that's right. So I'll put Lammy away. Or oh, you think this is a dog, don't you? No, I'm a trainer. <laughs> Mum thinks it's a dog. Mum thinks it's a dog, you think it's a lamb. Yeah, maybe Story will become a dog trainer. So into the toy basket. And a place with another one. Poppy, fetch! Yeah, new value. You come to check on me, Poppy. I'm doing a drone check. What? Now we've got this trip booked to Mindanao. I want to make sure we can film things. From this guy. No, don't you bite my drone, you. Hmm? That's not a good thing. <laughs> Still trying to get the camera fixed. I ordered a new gimbal, which is what makes the camera stable. 
from Lazada. So hopefully that will arrive in time and we'll be able to get some aerial shots of our trip over to Mindanao, back to the Bukid Non region. I did look into buying a new drone and they're just so expensive, it's out of the question. So I'm just gonna try and see if I can do the hard work on this myself. This has served us for a long time now, almost as long as we've had story. It is interesting because when you fly a drone a lot, you kind of have your own pilot log where it stores online with a GPS data, a tracker, like everything, every single flight path you've taken, how fast you were flying, how high you were flying, what country you were in. So you can actually go and see your experience level for how long you've been flying for. And it gives you a rating, like a kind of pilot grade in a way. And this one, if you look through the flight log, you can see it goes way back to Thailand. You can see my flight experience from when Story was just a little seed in mommy's tummy. <laughs> so much. It's amazing the kind of technology we've got to document our lives with these days. What are you doing now, Poppy? I just saw her trying to grab this bag. What, you wanna take your little vacation bag with you? Hmm? You wanna start packing? We've got a couple of weeks before we're going anywhere yet. You little nibbler. It's time to plunge that coffee. These are the mocha beans that we got from Goodies. It's a very different taste, isn't it? It is super different. It doesn't even taste like coffee. It's quite nice, mm. but it's just, yeah, it's different. It doesn't have that coffee. -ness. No. Hit, it's like, yeah, to me, drink. it tasted a bit like a Chinese herbal tea. Like, <laughs> it's so different <laughs> that it had that kind of. And also, because we're not using the espresso machine and it doesn't come out with crema or anything, it has a different type of experience altogether. Yeah. <laughs> the coffee world is complex, isn't it? Know, yeah. Poppy, where did you get Sori's shorts from? Right, drop it. What Look, she's got her little pink shorts on. Where'd she get those from? Mm, you can't leave anything anywhere these days. <laughs> you naughty little pup. Look at that massive ear, you're listening to me, aren't you? Yeah, I can see. You little fox. You gonna be a naughty pup? You're gonna be a good pup. We'll train you. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little morning's update. Story's running around, she's about to do a little... What are you gonna do over there, Story? Crafting? Vetting. You're gonna do some vetting. Play with your vet kit, right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to do a little bit more poppy training after breakfast and we'll see you next time. Bye! <laughs> She's about to bite me.